What's up everybody, Miss Montana De Leon, and I'll put my link down below to my Facebook page if I can remember to put it there so you guys can join in on the topics that I put up. Um, you would have to subscribe to my page instead of click to add friend, just click to subscribe. Um, and this is the topic yesterday. Another reason why people run in relationships and don't want to want to work through the hard times is because when you have to face you and your shortcomings in a relationship, they don't want to admit to being a part of the problem. But little do you know, um, you got to love when you discover your shortcomings and you should, and you should, you should love and embrace your shortcomings, work on them, fix them because, um, it gives you the opportunity to improve yourself, to grow, to mature, and to get better at this thing called relationships. Um, don't be ashamed. Don't run from the ugly truth. Use it as a stepping stone to become a better you. I've never addressed this before on my channel, but I mean, it's it's common. It's very common sense, but we don't want to um, acknowledge the fact that sometimes we're wrong in relationships. We're the problem that relationships don't work. So anytime somebody points out something to you, you want to own up to it. You want to fix that issue. You want to work on that issue. You want to ask your mate how to help you work on that issue so you can get better. Because with each relationship, hopefully, we take something from it. And we learn our lesson from it and what not to do in the next relationship. Um... Just evaluate yourself. Just think about every argument that you had and think about what you could have done different, what you could have done to make it run smoothly. If the shoe was on the other foot, what you, what you wish your mate would have done to make it easier on you. When you can own up to your shortcomings and own up to your faults and own up to your flaws, you can get past them. You can grow and mature, finally. Um, but I'm going to make this video really, really short. But, yeah, for all of you out there watching this video, definitely look at yourself in the mirror. Look at your relationships. Look at why they're not working. And if, not saying that it's always you because it's never always both parties. Sometimes it's just the other party and you're doing everything right or, for the most part, everything right. But sometimes it is you. Think about the reasons why you guys broke up or why you guys are having problems right now. And this is something that you can do to... Make it better, ease it, uh, take the stress off the relationship. Just evaluate yourself and be the bigger person and be like, you know what, that is messed up and I do want to, I ain't, you know, get in this relationship for it to end like this or this soon. I do want to be with this person. I do want to have a relationship. So let me work at keeping a relationship. And, um, yeah, you'll feel much better and you'll get further when you own up to your mistakes and learn from them and grow from them. You feel me? All right, you guys. I'm going to make this really short. I'm out of here. Love some. Come on, do it with me. Yay.